Kuvira misuri? Apana. Apana. Wana pika watu masashi sana. Banditisme. Good morning everyone from Bujumbura, Burundi. Today I was trying to go to Congo for the third time. I actually went there the first time, but I didn't get the visa that was from Bwindi in the west of Uganda. And then I managed to cross over the mountains and stay there some days in Congo, but I didn't get the visa, so I don't count it. The second one I was in Rwanda. Yeah, I tried to get the visa also. They wouldn't allow me to go because of COVID restrictions. And the last time was in Brazzaville recently where I had the Congo visa, but because of COVID I couldn't cross the lane border, which is like five kilometers away from Kinshasa. Uh, you could see the city from Brazzaville basically it's the two closest capitals in the world still the officials wouldn't let me go they said I needed some documents which would take me a week to get and I had to pay like $500 which is very stupid so my only option was to fly to Addis Ababa which is 24 hours and then fly there and that's very expensive and makes no sense so now I'm trying to go from Burundi to Uvira a city that nobody goes to basically I have some hope that it will be possible for me to cross. Yesterday I paid $100 for a COVID test here in Burundi. That doesn't help me one bit. I still have to do a COVID test on the border from Burundi to Congo. When I come into Congo and when I go back, I also have to do the same. So that's four extra PCR tests, like $50 each. Yeah, it's just very expensive to travel in Africa now. Even though I'm vaccinated, it doesn't help me one bit. I still have to pay all the time, but I'm in a good mood. I'm gonna get around six COVID tests in four days. So crazy. Get ready to get jumped from every side here at the border. <laughs> Let's go, Congo. Missouri Sana. They are doing everything to get money here. They just keep on wasting my time in order to enter Congo. So frustrating. They, they say now they refuse to give me my entry visa. Right now I'm so pissed off. So corrupt. They gave me the entry and now they make problems. There's another guy coming. In. I'm not sure I'm, I'm not sure I can go in. Right now there's another chief they need to talk to. It's always a new chief, new chief, new chief who needs to discuss the details. One of the most corrupt countries, DSC, unfortunately. I'm sad to say and I hope someone will work on these problems. That's why I make this video because it's disgusting. It's really not nice. It's not good. I already started to yell a bit at the guys. So another guy take over, a uh, guy that I just met today, to talk to them because I cannot. I have the visa. I paid two hundred dollars for the visa in Cameroon, and still they make problems. Like I have the DSC visa. Everything is okay. Entry dates, and still they are making a big show out of it. They make a lot of troubles. Whew. I come from a country like when you have everything in order, everything is fine. And then you come here to DSC where you have everything in order and then there still are a lot of problems. Then it's easy to get frustrated and I really am right now. So this is the most corrupt border I've ever been to. One of the most corrupt borders. Yeah. Welcome to Congo. Karibo Congo. Karibo Congo. Karibo Sana. Wolf. That was a rough one. Uh, I found my Cameroonian residence and now I'm inside. Yes. They say first I cannot go. So I find my uh, Cameroonian yeah. residence. They say okay. Super. Now I'm in Congo, yeah? Yes, this is Congo. I was lucky to get in. This is it took me two hours, two and a half hours. Yes. How are you? Good. This one in Congo? This yeah, is yeah, yeah. Congo. This uh, is Congo. Okay. Sunday, Sunday. Congo. Rafik Yango. It's made in Bukavu, this beer. It's really good. Primus, country 161. Happy to be here in Congo. <laughs> yeah? This one, what is that? So the guys just gave me this one. Chikata. I don't know what it is. Okay. Costa? 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 <laughs> Strong stuff. Ah. Only in Congo. <laughs> so I'm just smoking with my new country's friends. Boom. Big shot. Nice to be here in Congo. Lingala, Francis. Lingala, Francis. Swahili. Swahili. Kikongo. Kikongo? Chino language. Kongo. National. National. Okay. Which one uh, biggest? The biggest is uh, French. Patrick. Patrick. Yeah. <laughs> The natural whistle. 
This place is called Vietnam House in Congo, in the city that nobody visits. There are many criminals in Uvira? Yes, yeah, there are so many criminals in Uvira. Most of them are young guys from the city. They are thinking about how to get money, how to pay food, something like that. They do whatever they can do to get money. And some of them, they choose to guns, they can walk with gun in night and when they found someone they ask for money they take your phone they take your things and others they can enter even if in houses yes you think it's dangerous uh, it's dangerous mostly in night and sometimes you know in Uvira there are uh, Rwandese trap and uh, Congolese trap and sometimes they fight between these uh, two trap you know and when they are fighting it, uh, it's hard you know it shoot everywhere uh, the police shoot to to cool down people yes and sometimes it uh, it's dangerous you have many phones swahili kirok yote yote wewe ni chanbela jesus elmali oh a lot of bread you know burundi bread burundi bread abari wewe salama kabisa germany Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, good. Certificate. Yeah, oh. Many documents. Yes. And many phones. <laughs> you are a man of many things. You have many phones, you have many documents. Mingi Mingi. You are Mingi Mingi man. If you don't have any documents, you are nothing in Congo. You need your documents. Now we are in Uvira. We are in Uvira now. In Uvira, in South Kivu. Oh, east of nice. South Kivu. The second biggest city in South Kivu. Yes. The second town in... Yes. Yeah. The second city. Which one is the biggest? Bukavu. Masamati. Driving around Uvira, so happy to be in DRC, man. So happy. Finally made it to DRC in a good, proper way. Hi, buddy. Sorry, how are you? Good to meet you. Okay, so now we are checking out our room here in Congo. This is a Yes, the kids. But you know, in Congo, here we don't have water in the rooms. We'll survive, I hope. Yeah, we can go to the lake. We can go to the lake and break. Yeah, why not? Yes, sir. Oi. Mosquito net. We even have our own television. <laughs> nice. This is a must <laughs> everywhere in Africa. We need these ones. The slippers. And the toilet. Alright, man. Uvira. <laughs> Cameroonian resident. Nice to be here. Hello, brothers. Someone just came and gave me money? Uh, okay, thanks. Vira! Very hot! Moto! Very hot. How do you feel? Feels very good, very clean. Okay, thank it's you. A natural way. They bring the big weapons. Okay. Sunday guys. Quiet. Yeah. Welcome to Congo. <laughs> So I'm here at the port in Uvira in Congo and uh, we just have a little flight over here. It does look like it's in the best conditions but maybe it will be in the future. You never know. They are making business from Rio to Tanzania. This is the business boat of DRC. That's how you make money here if you have the money at first. Even if I'm interested in one, time, one day when I get money, around $5,000, I'll make one. So we have some fuel over here. A oh, very strong guy, he carried two suitcases. Very strong Congolese guy. Alright, so we'll just check out the boats here in Uvira. 
They look really cool. Some really cool tree boats in the second biggest city in South Kivu. Oh, that's a really colorful guy there. Uh, you have fisher? Are you the fisherman? Uh, fisherman? Uh, uh, Davido. Davido. Davido? Uh, Davido? Uh, the singer? David. David. Ah, okay. So, so. Uh, yeah. Hey. 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 Who can go for it? Who can go for it? He's very strong. Jambo. Comes with uh, with the river, unlivable. Nobody lives there. Nobody. Okay, the because the water went up, then uh, a lot of these houses are destroyed, so you cannot live there any longer. Since how many years? Two years. Two years. Yes. Driving around the city, what an experience! So many nice people. They are not as camera shy as they are. It's a very busy market. See people, they sell all kind of stuff here in Congo. This city is absolutely bustling. And up here, we have a very beautiful view of the mountains. The Obira is definitely something special. It's so crazy, you meet so many personalities. Now it's time to have some food. Sande. Yes, sir. Congo de soda. You are welcome at Congo. Isuri. Yes. Pizza lo. In Uvira, there are a lot of malaria. You have to take some medicine, preventive medicine, against uh, malaria. It's starting to rain now, but we'll try to go up to the top and get the view of the city. Some cool views of the city from up here. This is the Molongwe area of the city and a lot of action here. I have heard a lot of things about the Congolese roads, but they are really not the best. No, the people are nice, but the roads are not the right. And they ask a permit for this kind uh, of road. Oh my God. Brother, you're sleeping too much. <laughs> African time, man. Eh? Yes. Hello. What's up, man? I'm okay. You had good sleep? Good. Too much uh, Lala Salama. I'm Lala Salama, Salama today. <laughs> you also have a solid fence. Protection is everything, Han Uvira. Broken limo. Maybe I can fix it. Uvira is a very interesting place to visit. They have a lake, they have a lot of boats, and really nice people. And I'm happy to be here finally in DRC, Congo.